We're here at Joshua Tree National Park in California to test the range of our Morse Micro Wi-Fi Halo chip. This quiet valley is the perfect place to test the limits of our maximum range as there's very little RF noise. To start with, we set up one of our evaluation kits as an access point at the edge of the valley. We've also done a few calculations on the theoretical maximum range and the quality of the RF signal and data rates we might expect at those distances. The max range is simply distance equals speed times time. The Wi-Fi Halo RF signal travels at the speed of light and our system has a maximum time of flight of 53 microseconds. So this gives us a theoretical maximum range of 15.9 kilometers. The next step is working out how strong the signal is at this maximum range. The further a signal goes, the weaker it becomes. This is known as the free space path loss. Using Free's transmission equation, we'll put in our target range and the RF frequency. This gives us a loss of 116 dB. Our DKH01 has an output power of 21 dBm with a 1 dB antenna gain. So a total radiated power of 22 dBm. With a free space path loss of 116 dB, this gives us a received signal of minus 94 dBm. Our second device is set up as a station. As we move further away and the signal weakens, the rate control will adjust the MCS rate to ensure both high throughput and a reliable connection. What we want to know is the throughput at the maximum range. Using our MCS rate table, based on the signal strength of minus 94 dBm, we should get MCS2 at 4 MHz. This gives us a phi throughput of 4.5 megabits per second, or a UDP MAC throughput of about 4 megabits per second. Based on our calculations, we should be able to get a signal at roughly 16 kilometers with quite a decent throughput. Once we were close to the theoretical maximum range, we took to foot to find a good spot to place the station. Here we are in Joshua Tree National Park. Uh, we've done some range testing here today. Um, we've got set up uh, about 10 miles at the end of the valley. We've got an access point set up, and over here, we've got a station set up. But we get about two megabits per second. It is a line of sight environment, and it's a pretty uh, quiet RF environment. Uh, so pretty good uh, environment for getting long range. It's still phenomenal that we've managed to get uh, two megabits per second over Wi-Fi at about 10 miles range. This would be perfect for peer-to-peer -peer applications. Think body cams, walkie-talkies for skiing, hiking, cycling, or dune buggying. It would also be great for IoT in other rural settings, such as farming and mining. Yeah, and this is just with our EKH01 eval kit, uh, 21 dBm output power, it's about 125 milliwatts. You can buy it on Mauser. You can come test it out yourself if you want to.